One of the things that I was growing up that I thought I really wanted to be was a teacher. I had always uh, played school when I was little. I had my own um, classroom with desks and a, a chalkboard and books and my sisters were the students. And uh, I had always wanted, really wanted to go into teaching. I really, really enjoyed it. Um, but at the time when I graduated from high school, that wasn't really an option. There were no teaching positions available back in the early 70s. And I was really counseled to go into nursing. And uh, the guidance that I got at the high school at the time was, you know, you're really good in science. So what about looking at a medical career? which at that time for women primarily was in nursing. So I thought, you know, 17, what do you know? Okay, sign me up. And uh, it, I really loved it, you know, once I got into it. In terms of my educational preparation, I started off as uh, in a diploma program, which are pretty much gone today. You don't see a diploma nursing program anymore. But I think my sights have always been on an academic setting and teaching in that setting. And so once the, I got the kids through college and um, could kind of do what I wanted to do in terms of my, my passion, which is teaching, I thought, you know, I'd really like to get into the academic setting. So I went back to get my doctorate in uh, nursing. And a lot of my cognates, I focused in on education as some of my cognates and electives. So went to the Graduate School of Education that was at the University of Buffalo where I received my master's in nursing also at UB. My career has gone and progressed. Another door opened and the dean, Dr. Diane Cooney Minor at the Wegman School of Nursing asked me if I was interested in perhaps teaching full-time uh, at Fisher. Now the interesting thing about me is that in my director role at Highland Hospital, I was able to meet all of the different faculty from different schools of nursing in this area. I oriented all of their students as new graduate nurses. So I really truly knew that the students coming out of Fisher, our nursing students coming out of Fisher were just extraordinary. And I could see that as they started their practice at Highland. They were engaged. They were leaders in our organization. And um, I really felt like Fisher was probably the place that I wanted to work. But the thing about Fisher that I really liked is that the mission certainly was very um, similar to what I believe in, in having a student-centered approach to your teaching, having a focus on teaching. Um, and I think that's one of the reasons why, you know, Fisher uh, was a, a very viable option for me. And when that door opened, um, I really had to think about that because I had a 37-year career um, plus at Highland, and that was hard to give up. Um, but coming here to Fisher, I think, is a, has been a, a good complement for that.